Hi guys, welcome to RRC part 9 of the Tamiya Mercedes AROX uh, 4151 tipper truck. Um, managed to get the cab painted. Um, doesn't look too bad. Uh, there were some things I'm unhappy about, um, but um, just a lot of time going into it at the moment, guys, to, to get that resolved. So I've done what I can, so it, it, it looks okay. Uh, as far as I'm concerned anyway, so Yeah, so I'm gonna be built in this video. I'm gonna be building up the uh, The cab putting the screens in uh, putting all the bits and pieces that go on the cab uh, And getting it to a point where I can fit it to the truck. So okay guys, let's get on with it So this is just putting the side window in and The mirror on guys I'll get this one done and then I'll put the other one on and we'll see what it looks like. Now, if you're wondering, guys, why I've blacked these windows out, um, it's because of the MFC um, where it's mounted. You can't get the seats and dash in, and all you will see is wiring despite you trying to be as tidy as you possibly can with the wiring. Um, so, Hence why I've had to do it, guys. Didn't want to do it, wanted to put a driver in this one, but fortunately not, that's the way it is with the Tamiya. I suppose there's not a lot they can do about it. Electronics have got to go somewhere, I suppose. Hey guys, I'll get on with the other one. Okay guys, there's uh, both door mirrors on, see them uh, hopefully. Uh, so let's get on with the rest of it. Hey guys, that's the uh, front windscreen in. See, so looking okay. Pretty neat guys, I think. Lifting the cab up. Stole that for a few seconds.
can get the next one done. Same again guys, just uh, hold it there for a bit. guys that's it so far okay guys this is the just the uh, spotlight frame that we're putting together now <clears throat> just getting the uh... seeing how it's going together to glue the lenses into these guys so be really careful try not to get it on the chrome because it will ruin it yeah okay guys I'll get the lenses into all these spotlights and then we'll get on with putting it onto the frame hey okay, guys the Glued them lenses are glued in there now, so let's try and get this first one on here. That's the first one on there, so I'll get the rest on and I'll get you back on. Okay, that's guys, that's what the uh, spotlight frame looks like. Um, they don't seem to fasten on the backs very well. Uh, maybe it's because, I don't know, this wire is thicker, maybe. The LEDs are the same size, but the GT power wire is slightly thicker than the um, Tamiya. So I don't know that's what's causing it, but they're on there guys, they seem to be holding there, but it wouldn't take much to disturb them, but they look pretty cool, like. Okay, that's that done, let's get on with the rest. So guys, in, in order to um, mount this spotlight frame, uh, to me, I've not drilled any holes in this lid, so what I, uh, well, in this top bit. So what I think there is, is this, it does the earlier tipper truck as well, so you have to drill. I mean, they have made indentations where you've got to drill, you know, however, a little bit um, airy just having to do that. So anyway, before we do anything, we've got to drill these holes and we've also got to cut this piece out here if you're using the MFC to allow for the wires to go through. So let's get on with it. Okay guys, I've got the rest of the cut out to get the holes drilled and I'll get you back on. Okay, all the, the holes are drilled. Uh, they they'll go on the spotlight bar. So we uh, just need to get on with that.
Okay guys, that's the uh, spotlight bar connected to the, well, fastened to the roof, I should say. Looks pretty good. A bit of thread lock on these um, bolts to hold the visor on. Sorry, I can't get you in on it. Doing this, guys. I'm just putting some thread lock on the on this uh, other bolt for the visor. Okay guys, that's the um, visor on and the lights through. Um, bit awkward, you know, bit of patience and, you, and you'll get there. So yeah, looking good so far guys. I love the uh, simulated cab release, it's uh, really good. Okay, let's get on with the next one.
checking the side guys, bracket at the back. Let's just use a little, I think they're air deflectors guys, uh, on the side there, or wind deflectors, sorry. Okay. Okay hey guys, that's the um, air intake stack put on, uh, the wiper blades are on and the little uh, handles that go on the front, uh, they're, they're on. Um, so the next thing is to get it mounted onto the actual truck, so we'll get on with that. Okay hey guys, there's the cab uh, mounted on the hinge there. I haven't fastened the stay because uh, there's some work to be done underneath tidying the wires up, um, fitting the speaker in there uh, and a few of the little bits and pieces. But once that's uh, done, um, I'll get the stay on. But uh, not looking too bad guys. Okay, that's it for this video, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye for now.